Hey guys, it's me and Shaki again for another Living Life in Full Stride video blog. And today we're going to be talking about a special topic that I am uh, a strong believer in, and that's autonomy, empowerment, and freedom in the projects that you do and uh, the different positions that you hold. Um, so this is going to be pretty short. I want to keep it uh, hopefully under three minutes, but um, what we're going to talk about is both on the finding a job side, finding the right employer, but then what you can do so that whoever you apply to or wherever you end up, whoever you work with knows the kind of things that, that I'm about to describe. So what I think is a strong force that is a strong motivator and really gets the best people doing the best kind of work is giving them a lot of freedom, a lot of ownership of their projects, uh, empowering people really. So in a lot of the organizations I'm in or the past positions I've held, um, I try and make sure that both my superiors know that I can handle it and I really want to take as much on as I can so that I can really own the project and put my heart into it. But as well as those that I'm working with or maybe that are um, rarely under me, they know that I want to give them as much freedom as possible as well so that they can be, feel empowered and do an awesome job. And you know, it's micromanaging versus uh, macromanaging or not micromanaging, I don't know. And I, I'm a strong disbeliever in micromanaging because I feel like there's a lack of trust there. And um, that brings me to my, ne my next point. How can you find the right employers or people to work with that understand that you like the autonomy, the freedom? As Gen Y, we like to have our own ownership and feel like what we're doing is for a bigger cause and actually means something. It's not just tedious work. But how do you show that? And really, it starts right now. You have to build your personal brand. Uh, show that you can handle big projects like that. You are a leader um, for whatever you're doing because it's all about trust, like I said. The way that you're going to get more responsibility and freedom to kind of pursue your own projects or pursue your own passions is if whoever you're working with trusts that you can do it without them helping or intervening. So trust is probably the biggest Thing that you have to accomplish. It's really, really hard to build and it's very easy to lose. So you have to be you know, very careful with how you present yourself and how you interact with people, and especially your projects. You better do very, very well when you get a project that's completely your baby. You, know, you want to grow it the best you can so that when others see it, they'll actually be impressed. So a lot of information, pretty quick, hopefully, but I um, just want to let you know that as a Gen Y business professional myself, that is one thing I am strongly passionate about is empowering people. Uh, one of my personal quotes is empower yourself by empowering others because there's many leaders in the world right now and the truly effective best leaders understand that they're not the only leader and they need to help or empower others so that they can also accomplish their goals and collaborate and build a better world together. So that's all for now. Um, stay tuned. In the next couple of weeks, I'll actually be traveling and we'll have some on the road video blogs, hopefully. So stay tuned for that. And as always, um, live life in full stride.